A, get your regulator, soft air fitting on one side, quick disconnecting on the other, high pressure gauge, here's an adapter you can make for a low pressure gauge. This end, that end, that'll just go in line. Then here's your hose that will connect here. And this end right here connects there. Apply these push connector air lines and just different brass fittings and whatnot to, to apply to what you're testing. That's where all that come from. Trust me, you do want to make one of these. Here's all different adapters that we make for our pressure test kits. Different plugs and just all kinds of adapters. There's one for testing the AC compressor. You'll notice this line here. That's for pressurizing the air conditioning system. Different adapter plates. Plugs. So here's our Packard oil cooler. All right, Mr. Denver, if you would plug that line up for us. It's already adjusted and everything. Yeah, that one right there. This is already set. Yeah. Okay. And there's your Packard problem. Oil cooler's leaking. Only at two pounds. Two pounds. So if you set your own air test rig up, you can pressure test stuff like this and save a lot of headache. So now it's time to take this apart and repair it. There's the problem right there. Leaking right on that seam right there. That's the oil cooler that was inside that housing. We should be able to repair that. This little thing here caused all that problem. Still got to take the oil pan off and clean it out too.